I still see your shadows in my room. Can't take back the love that I gave you. It's to the point where so what is on my name is here back with another video you guys with an NBA team. I think Chicago Bulls Monday guys number 18 and today uh, we're gonna be taking on the Atlanta Hawks here at the United Center. Trey Young, Derek Rose, Levine, Kevin Hurrier, and uh, John Collins, Larry Markin should be a fall one as Levine buries in the first bucket of the Bulls game. And uh Markin, no foul call, but he buries in the three over Trey Young. And uh, Rose drives in, find one, finds one of our junior who gets the green on the elbow jumper, 8-7 uh, so far. Now Rose is going to slither on into the paint floater alert, and he drops it in with a green light. Rose hits the deck, no foul called, but uh, Levine's going to find Otto Porter who's going to stop, pop, green, drop the three, and that goes down. Bulls and Hawks all dead even here at 15. Now Rose gets the steal on Trey Young, Rose. Finds Wendell Carter Jr., who goes up strong right over Trey Young. Should be an easy basket, and it is. Uh, Rose now going to go straight uh, to pull the three, and he hits it. 22-19 will be the end of the first quarter score, and Rose had takeover for a little while, and marketing throws that one down. Carmel Anthony finds Denzel Valentine. Valentine hits the three on the right wing. 27 now, 19. Bulls trying to add, get some separation, but the Hawks do come back. Now Markin's feeling it. He's popping the three right over Kevin Herter. Kevin Lee contested. Doesn't have, I don't know why it's Kevin Lee contested because it's Herter. But now a nice steal from the Bulls. Now Bobby Portis is trying to go coast to coast. He's a little slow, though. So he's going to find Carmel Anthony, who's cutting in and one with the slam. Now Bobby Portis got Tarn Prince on him. He's going to go inside and throw it down. Bobby Bucket's getting uh, buckets. <laughs> and uh, you know what? That's that's what he does. So Bobby Portis is going to drive inside. Another shot goes down. Four points, one board, one, and also an assist. And Portis now is going to go inside, use his size, and he's going to score that as the Bulls are now up by one. We're going to find Carmelo. Carmelo inside. I love it because it's just the switch on this play. So it's an easy two points for Bobby again. He's got eight points now. And 41 to 38 will be your halftime score. 62 percent and 61 uh, for each team. You know, pretty pretty even game. You know, on both sides for all categories. And Rose is going to find Otto Porter. Otto Porter goes up strong. Green line layup is good. Bulls up by seven now uh, against the Hawks. And now we're going to find Levine. Levine's going to drive in on Herder, and he throws it down over Herder. And I'm probably saying his name wrong, but you know, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, as Levine's going to go uh, against Kevin, and he's going to score. Not even looking right there as he changed his hands. Uh, you know, well, yeah, he did. He went from right to left and wasn't even looking. Now Levine, bad shot, gets blocked. He's going to spin away. And now he's going to drive inside, spin move again. And this time, he's going to get that to go. A little better shot selection there. And that's going to go down, of course, with a green light. And Levine going to do a little weird crossover. It works, though, because he's going to throw it down. And Levine's got takeover. Uh oh, Levine with takeover is some cheese. And Zach Levine throws it down. That was over, I think, Kyle Anderson? Or was it over? Yeah, it was. And so Levine just elevates and throws it down, showing off the athleticism there. And now Levine gets the steal on Baysmore, and he's going to fly in with the reverse. Like I say, pretty much every video, uh, it would not be a video without, uh, you know, Chicago Bulls Molly video without Levine doing the slam. Um, just, it just happens every time. So Levine's going to go coast to coast, and he's going to get the green light layout to go and prepare to be amazed. Zach Levine, take over, finds a man in the paint. Windmill dunk! Sit down, Anderson. Levine goes all the way with a windmill contact dunk slam. Take over. Oh, my gosh. That was a full windmill, folks. And he almost just jumped over him, too. And look at look at this. His, his he almost dunked, dunked over him. And the windmill is nasty. Anderson's on the floor. Oh, he's pissed, bro. Oh, my gosh. He is mad that he just got murdered. Well, we're going to say that. Uh, but he, he just got dunked on, bro. That is tough. Man, he just stood there and Levine took care of business. Look at this cheese, bro. Look, look at the jersey glitch. Levine's gained a few pounds. He's been eating a few too many burgers looking like Eddie Lacy. And <laughs> look at Levine, no, Just an amazing slam. Oh, my gosh. Goodness, look at that. That is some cheese. Anderson, he's not even looking at Levine. He's just standing there knowing what he's knowing what's gonna happen, that he's just gonna get dunked on like that. That's tough. That's posterizer. And uh, you know, <laughs> posterizer adds fullest with the windmill slam. And uh, Anderson just it's just he's just on the floor, you know what? That's I would do that too. I would just sit there. I'd I would not even pound the floor, I'd just be sitting there because I'd be like, wow. 
my NBA career is now over. Um, anyway, Levine showing what he's got. He's taking over here, and he just goes in and scores and one. Why not? Levine having a phenomenal game, and now Carmelo Anthony comes up with this on Trey Young. Carmelo Anthony just goes up and scores. I'm not even sure why Carmelo is supposed to be guarding Trey Young, but um, Bobby Portis now hop step. And he's going to go up strong and score over Tyron Prince. Green light layup is good. And uh, pulls up by 13 here. And we're going to find Bobby Portis inside. So Carmelo has a small defender on him. So he's going to do a little drop step. And he's going to get that to go. I believe that's each one more. The Bulls killer. And uh, you know, Bobby, or Otto Porter is going to score there uh, with a floater. And now we're going to find Markin. And Markin pops a three green. Buries it. Markin's got uh, you know some buckets there. Rose has seven points. Also seven assists. And Markin is feeling it. Could not get the three to go. But he does get the foul call. And Levine now has 22. Make it 25 as he buries in the three in the left wing. And the Bulls are really pulling away now. Markin in. Probably going to take a shot. But instead he waits for the open one card Jr. Let's him get a bucket. He's, he's got six points, nine boards. And look at this. You say I got off your swags, oh, baby. You know the rules. Chris move. And Markin's getting the crowd hype here in Chicago. And now he's just pulling a three lightly contested over John Collins with a couple seconds left marketing is gonna let one more go and it goes down 95 to 73 what a performance from the Chicago Bulls scoring all those points and uh, yeah 73 points for the Hawks but uh, we're not gonna get any game highlights just to sit out buzzer beater from marketing as he was really feeling it there in the fourth getting some more buckets he had 28 in last episode I believe he had 31 so marketing has been on a tear lately 7 to 12 from deep Levine 11 to 17 the windmill dunk uh, Portis with a great game Rose uh, had you know some good stuff as well Ron Carden Jr. with double digit rebounds um, yeah and uh, on the other side, Trey Young, 26, 9 and 24, 10 from deep. Kevin Herter, 5 of 5 from the field. But if you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, go ahead and drop a like on the video and subscribe for more content. I'll see you guys in the next one, episode number 19. See you then. Peace.